to get on to the next one, man. Oh Lord, um, women are not getting their bodies done for themselves. Oh shit! I'm gonna play this clip, man. Get y'all take on it. So it's like all of a sudden, mm -hmm. now women are getting surgery for themselves. No, they're not. Yourself ain't looking at your fat ass. Yourself can't see your fat ass mm -hmm. other than in a picture and in the mirror. Damn, you're getting surgery it. because you want attention from a certain type of man. Mm -hmm. You're not getting surgery because you you want to look at yourself with a fat ass or, or because yeah. you're insecure or with I your body. Good. Because if your body shape became in style tomorrow, you would do everything you can to revert back. If if boxy girls, if up and down, straight, slim girls, <laughs> was it, if no hips, was if hips was not hot, y'all are getting your hips removed. So it's like, stop acting like... Like you're doing it for yourself you're not doing that for yourself and now there are times where you have a baby and things drop or mm -hmm. things pop and yeah. you want to put it back that's yeah. we're not talking about that's you that's different like, but the majority of y'all the, the especially you 19 year olds that didn't even get a chance to get hips and 20 year olds that didn't even get the chance to get it y'all are doing it because you want validation from a certain type of guy you see the girls that are winning and the ones that are getting the Bentleys and the Maybachs and you want to be like them so you're trying to get yep. your ass fat and you're trying to get them titties big and it's just not but they don't and promote they how many girls that get that change with their body and then love. they don't have and they don't live that life and, and like they gonna eat me up for this and I'm okay with that but it's just like love yourself give yourself a chance did you go to the gym for a year did you Man. lock in with your nope. diet for a year nope. so it's like all of a sudden mm -hmm. now women are getting mm. these women are not getting the Bro. BBLs and the bodies done for themselves what's that's your thoughts fact. on it man that's a fact <clears throat> that's 100 percent facts you do have little scrapes in there of women doing it for health reasons mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or they didn't came off a bunch of babies or whatever, with a couple babies, and they just can't get back to what they used to be. Then they go get the surgery. That's fine and dandy. We're not talking about you women. We're talking about the women like she just said, you 18, 19, you ain't even filled out yet. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You ain't even made it to be a stallion. You still a goddamn cub out here. <laughs> and you going to get some damn surgery and wonder why you stay under the knife at 19, 20, 21. You ain't even, you ain't even allow yourself to grow yet. Then the other women that's that's that 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 are grown and she just like, I wanna compete with the rest of these these youngins out here. Mm. So they go do that. But I just seen a live with a lady. She went and got all the shit done. And she was just talking about that, like a lot of women go get that and they don't get the life. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's only she was like, it's only like two percent of the women that go get all this shit and get the life, get the Bentleys, get the <clears throat> roses and all that type of shit there. You know, the rest of them. She just verbatim my I'm, I'm, man. Why she deleted that that live on on Twitter? But the rest of them are subjected to OnlyFans. That's what they go do because they got the body. There ain't no perverts and weirdos to pay them to do things to, with their body. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then the other ones, they subject themselves to talking outside their race because they know when they they fine, somebody else outside their race will use them as eye candy. You know what I'm saying? But she said that was a temporary situation because the girl don't really like them for real. And then the other ones, they uh they they finally come down after years and years of trying to chase the game. They go get them a regular guy that that everybody knows she wouldn't have picked if she would have got somebody else, if somebody else would have picked her. Mm. So that's the women that that that's got now. That's three, that's three, four different women, bro. Only like two percent really out here getting <clears throat> that money from niggas and really Living that life and all that type of stuff there. But everybody faking on Instagram, baby. Everybody, but you know how you could tell? After I seen that video, man, I just thought, man, attention. You know what I'm saying? Like when you go on, when, you, when you're when looking at these chicks' pages, bro, you go down her page, you never see a dude ever. It's only her taking amazing pictures. Mm. She trying to catch some. The chicks that already done caught them some, they with the brother. They have things. The dude is in the video. They laughing and smiling with, with dudes around, like maybe his friends or something or something. You know what I'm saying? They doing something with, with other guys around. Are they, are they looking homely? You know what I'm saying? No, never. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, they went and got BBLs. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> that's that's just open. a fact. Like, just looking at that on Instagram, bro, like, <laughs> you can tell the women that's lonely and really searching for the game and the women that already got it. Mm. They got they men. They got men around them. So, hey, if she got pictures and got no dudes on there, boy, you still got a shot. <laughs> Take your shot, boy.
I mean, Smooth bring up a good point. Oh, I wanna I wanna ask you because we didn't been on platforms or people didn't said this before. Do you feel like if she was that great, she would have a man already? Oh. Uh. <laughs> because I mean, basically, from what Smooth just said, he said the women who ain't really tripping on attention like that, they typically with their man or they typically you know amongst a group of friends where they ain't no pressure, they ain't doing extra to try to <gasps> present myself. The men just come to them. So do you you agree with that notion in which if you was that great, if you was that dope of a person, body was that right, mm-hmm. sex was that good, mm-hmm. you already have a man already. That's hard for me to So typically, I'm going to just go off. To, so typically, yes. Okay. However, I do know a lot of women who once, even when they get in relationships, they may want like their breasts done. That's just right. something that. It's always been, you know what I'm saying, maybe since they was like a teenager. Mm-hmm. They just knew, like, once I got in a certain position and saved up a certain amount of money, like, this is what I wanted to do at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. Um, I think that kind of been more common than anything or, or like a reduction. And right. then they've been getting men, you know, all their life. But as far as, like, the extra stuff with the BBLs and you want to get lip fillers and you want to change your whole face up, this cosmetic surgery, like, that's a, that's, that's a lot of – I don't want to say it's new because it's not new. But it's just kind of more like mainstream, like more people are doing it. Average people are doing it compared to like the celebrities. Like normally you saw the celebrities doing stuff like that. Now you can walk in the mall, go to a grocery store. You you liable to find you at least one. You know what's crazy? And that with a BBL or something like that. Growing up, the most we ever seen like chicks doing, and these was like, they wasn't even black chicks, but it was mostly the white chicks. Mm. It was getting breast jobs. That's what I'm saying. That was it. And Botox. Mm. And Botox. Mm. Breast that was, that was about Botox. it. The whole BBL, I don't know. I don't know where that came from. I well, just hate when women I know get where that. It came from. Yeah, I know where it came from. Kim K. Ugly and all that type of shit. Nah, it's the, the, the difference between now and then is the cost. Mm-hmm. Back then, there wasn't that many doctors doing it. Mm-hmm. So when that's the case, and they got a monopoly on the market, we hitting y'all for forty, fifty thousand 50000 to get this procedure done. So okay. whereas now, you can go to Miami, get it done for five, four, mm-hmm. the, the BBL. You know what I'm saying? I have women say they do, got it for four. Mm-hmm. So that right there makes it, Affordable. So if you think about four thousand dollars, when we was in college, we would get a refund check for <laughs> something close to that. And women definitely go through that. Too. You see what I'm saying? So it's like it, it makes it more accessible. Getting your teeth done, same way. You you gonna spend about you can spend about seven, eight, ten to go get it done. Now, it ain't gonna be right, done. Sure, later, I can do it with three. Right. Mm-hmm. So I mean, and, and again, depending on where you go, you can get it done for ten out here. Go to go Colombia, get it done for three. Right. Or Mexico, get it, you know what I'm saying, whatever. So that's what made it such a broad situation. But in terms of what she was saying, I I used to think that way. I did. You know, until I started having a lot of conversations with women, and then they put it in a perspective in which I could understand it. And I think it was hard for me to understand it because we didn't have much, type, much of that stuff available to us. But now we got, you know, BBLs for men. We got boys yeah. getting hair implants. Niggas trying to get inches on them as far as height. I, 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 I ain't gonna lie to you I'm gonna go get the hair plan. My shit get back here like Stephen A. That's right. <laughs> real I'm real. The, I'm, I swear to God. Because, yeah, because it's available to us. I'm just real nigga. You see what I'm saying? So it's like, but none of that stuff used to be available to us. Mm-hmm. It was all available to them. So that crafted the mindset like, nah, they gonna get that done to impress us. And don't get me wrong. <clears> it, a, a lot of them are. But a lot of them also just always wanted to tweak something about them. Just like mm-hmm. O just said, her breast might have just been always sagging. Mm-hmm. And she just wanted that shit to sit up. It ain't necessarily got to do with, okay, I'm trying to pull, pull a man with this, especially if you're going to get a reduction. Because mm-hmm. men want them as big as possible. We're going to keep it real. But, you know what I'm saying? It's just that she just wanted them sitting away. Or she mm-hmm. always felt like, damn, my lower waist is boxy as hell. I done did squats. I done did sit-ups. Mm-hmm. I done did crunches to try to adjust it. And it just don't work. So I got to go get that, that surgery so it can... Hourglass the way that I always wanted it to. Now, sure, you know, attention is is motivation for it as well. Mm-hmm. But you just want to be confident, and when you look in the mirror, confident when you put your clothes on, and you I feel, feel like, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm this motherfucker dress sitting right in comparison mm-hmm. to how it's sitting on this girl. Mm-hmm. And forever for me, when it would hit her waist, it would curve out. But for me, that bitch took like a church nightgown because right. I ain't had a shape that I but that I needed. You see what I'm though, saying? If you only getting one thing done, I just don't like the women that get everything done mm-hmm. and then start talking to other women like they was never. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, mm-hmm. that's true. That's true. But and and, and there's another thing I want to speak to. I, I don't, I don't, I don't disagree with that at all. But I think you know, for the people to say, "Damn, like what a line! Why you just keep going? Get shit adjusted." I, I I just went through this with my my old lady. She been on her on her workout journey. She lost like sixty pounds in like four months, something like that. But even still, she in the best shape of her life. Mm-hmm. 
And she's like, yeah, I need. I think I need to figure out a way to get my abs a little more. I'm gonna start doing workouts to try to tweak that. Now mind, she got the best abs in the whole gym. Mm-hmm. But it's like it's still like okay, yeah. But the abs popping right here. But right here, it's a little. Eh, I'm, I need to get the side crunches in, or you know, my thighs, my quads not sitting up as high as I may need them to. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna try to do what's workouts I can do to get that quad sitting. Mm-hmm. up. So it's gonna always be something that you're gonna want to tweak. And I feel like people who get the surgeries and stuff, again, that's different. Conversation, but they gonna be finding the same shit. Just like, just like, let's say the the hairline situation. You go get your hair done, your hairline done or whatever. You like, damn, my beard ain't always connected the way I want that motherfucker to. I just went and got that done. How much the beard? Twelve hundred, fifteen. Eh? All right, right here, man. Let me tear me up with that too. Then <laughs> get me right. I'm trying to get it all taken care of. You see mm-hmm. what I'm saying? So that's that's how it can just steamroll into just all kind of stuff being done. So again, sure. back in the day, I didn't really understand it. But when they explained it to me, I say, damn, you right. It's just like us in the gym. If we lifting and working out, chest get right. Damn, but my damn my traps ain't sitting the way they mm-hmm. need to. Let me go get let me go work on these traps. So mm-hmm. you know what my 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 bicep when I put the, my shit ain't sitting up high enough. Let me go do workouts to get that done. Now you looking great, but you always gonna find something to, you know what I mean? My abs right. ain't sitting out, my, my my chest ain't protruding like it need to be. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's that. It's you gonna always find something. Well, and, and I have no problem with that. I think but the difference is you're willing to put in the work to right. do it mm-hmm. instead of like she said, and Smooth was saying, you 18, 19, 20, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? You're doing this surgery, and you ain't even filled out yet. You still growing. You still developing. Like, I didn't have no beard when I was 20 years old. Mm-hmm. I would have loved to have one. Had a little skinny-ass chin strap. My shit, chin strap. Feel, my shit didn't <laughs> fill up till I was like 28. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So some shit you just got to wait for. And especially, like, women have kids. Like, that change your body. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Women get breasts. Women get ass. They get hips. They get all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? As time go on. But, yeah, I just don't agree with getting it done early. Yeah. If you get it done, cool. I'm not with it. You know, I would never date nobody with all that stuff. But I think it need to have an age limit on it. But it's still, like, like just um, give it some time. Like women getting their tubes tied and shit. That's what mm. I think. You know what I'm saying? I think it need to have an age limit on it, like, like 25 or 30. Because that could mess up so much 30. stuff down would, the line. I would say 30. That's what I would say. So where it's like, you, you, you got to be at least 30 <clears throat> to get something done? So yeah, you, you got to be, you got to, outside mm. of medical reasons, if you just go in there just to get it done... 30. But see, this is why I disagree with that. Maybe not 30. It's because of the, the women being able to have kids. Shit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, again, if, I, if, I, if I'm trying to be in my glow, and again, like I said, impressing men is part of it. We ain't going to sit there and act like that's just no part. That, it, mm-hmm. it plays a part. Mm-hmm. But if I want to be in my glow, I see, I, 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 I like the first number you said, about 25, 24. 24, 23. Is when I can, okay, because I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much what I'm going to be at this point, pretty much. Mm-hmm. And then, okay, I can do some additions or whatever the case may be. But if she wait till 30, some women struggle to have kids starting at 31, 32. I think the stats said 32 or something is when is when you start being at risk, start being at risk for the average pregnancies and stuff like that if you ain't had no kids by then. So they time clock is is a little different. So they want to get in their glow earlier. So okay, well, 25 would be a good age then. So, yeah. 25 years that done, shit, you got, what, now, five now they years? Now they're going to say we policing their bodies. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> look, man. But that, that's healthy. Cause, man, bro, can you imagine, bro, your, your daughter got damn 19. Hey, daddy, man, I want a I wanna BBL. Yeah, I'm that's gonna be sick to my stomach. Some, you know stuff, what I'm some stuff when I think about, from our perspective, I think, is what they don't get. We try to think from a logical perspective. It ain't that we trying to hinder them or tell them not to do stuff. Some stuff is just like just wait up just a little bit. Just, just like they got the, the dick extension. I think I think dudes don't need to be getting that today at least for it. <laughs> hey. Go get you some money first. Hey. You want you want some big horse dick, man? That's Go get you some horse dick money, man. But even dude, even dude who just got the surgery, he just added five inches. He got his he got his legs done. That was, uh-huh. that was on Twitter. You seen that? Yeah, mm-hmm. Five inches. Five inches. He added them five inches. He said, "Bro, I had to do what I had to do. I done been five. I think he went from five was, three was, to five uh, eight, eight yes. or something like that." But this that he shit matter he, though. He said he got confidence he got women that he wasn't getting before yeah. it, because again logically it's like you just said if you look in a certain way you're gonna get approached more that's just reality mm-hmm. that's just what it is that's logic so in their mind that's how they be thinking plus it's certain things about their body working out can't fix mm-hmm. if i want my ass to sit a certain way i can do all the squats in the world i want if i don't have ass it ain't happening mm-hmm. so Again, in some instances, I, I I get it. Breast as well. It ain't no workout that you can do to get your breast to sit up. Yeah. It's no way. It, it, it ain't nothing that's gonna do that. And that's something that men can't really understand. Yeah. Which is why we speak about it so 
recklessly. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, again, I I used to feel the same way she felt, and and I don't necessarily disagree with her completely because I think everybody want to be attractive. Everybody. Yeah, that's the same. In in one form or another. So sure, they are getting it done for that reason as well. But I feel like also. If I had to give it a split, 50, 50, 60, it'd be somewhere around there to where I want to like what I see when I look in the mirror. I want to feel confident with what I see. I want to feel like I'm, you know what I mean, getting in my bag the way I need to be when I'm looking in that mirror. And then as a byproduct of that, the attention going to come. But that just goes from, I think that, that goes from just the exposure, social media, the magazines, some of them be reading, yeah. mm-hmm. people they follow. Like, because a lot of people be in good shape. Like, mm-hmm. Some of these women that's getting this surgery, you'd be like, you was looking nice. But of course, that's outside opinion. That's exactly. not them. Mm-hmm. So that part I get. But it's like, damn. One, give yourself a chance. Two, don't, if you're going to do it, you shouldn't do it for the wrong reasons. Mm-hmm. Don't do it because you're trying to look like that person. Like, if you want to do it, do it because you want like your own self. But see, it's hard to say that, right? Because... 95% of the decisions we make are based on outside things we see. Mm-hmm. Things, are, things yeah. that we influenced by. You know what I'm saying? So she might have seen somebody that just had a, a cold ass body and be like, well, damn, it'd be nice if my shit set up like that. Let me mm-hmm. go try to see what I can do. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I don't feel like necessarily no harm with that. But you're right, there is a line, okay, in which it goes too far to where I'm trying to emulate. You usually got people out here getting surgeries trying to look exactly like a Kim K right. or exactly like an Ari Fletcher mm-hmm. or somebody like that. I feel like that's, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? But in terms of you seeing something that inspires you to want to upgrade, I mean, it's just like men with, with cars, right? Like your, your, your pops would tell you, boy, you was just fine with that Ford Focus. What the hell are you trying to go buy a damn Benz for? You don't need that. Or you was just fine with that two-bedroom apartment. Why are you trying to go get a five-bedroom house? It ain't nobody but you and, and your wife or you or whatever. Mm-hmm. And you like, pops, I hear you, but uh, I want this. I want my lifestyle to be like this. And I don't feel like it's no harm with that. If you put willing to put the work in and you can afford to go do it, mm-hmm. live your life how you want to live it. That's how mm-hmm. I see it. You know what I'm saying? But again, men don't look at it the same because men don't get judged for beauty the same way that women do. And that's all I'm saying, bro. That the women beauty need to be top notch at all because times. Because if be, you can have the best personality in the world, and this is hard to say, you can have the best personality in the world. And there's some women that's walking around and are walking examples of it. Cool as hell, man. Great conversation. Goddamn. Play. Make me laugh. All that. But if you don't look the way you need to look. The way them laughs are. <laughs> it ain't happening. At it. all. It ain't at happening. All, and that's unfortunate. Because with that men. Y'all are horrible people. No, that's that's real. real. Hold on. Y'all, you want to sit up here and lie? That's real, bro. <laughs> you know we don't be doing that line on here. That's <laughs> real, bro. You know it. It's been plenty of chicks throughout our lives. Even back when we were single. And we like, damn, she cool as a motherfucker. But she just don't look mm. the way I need her to look. That's real talk. That's it's harsh, but that's but the, and the thing about it is why beauty is not important as to men is because when that's the case for us, we just go get a bag and all that goes out the window. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. You got dudes who are ass ugly, look like the bottom of my Jordans, <laughs> but <Say> ass ugly. <laughs> you understand me? Just booty crack, terrible. <laughs> you hear me? But he got the bag. He got Damn, the bust down He got the you know what I mean? He got that foreign outside. And he pulling you see, up. You see that car? You, Oh, let's see. Like, oh yeah, I see why. I see why. <laughs> <laughs> it don't, it don't have it don't have to like that. Been waiting in the valet. Been waiting in the valet. Be like, yeah, that makes sense. That bad. That makes sense. <laughs> Is that eight though? <laughs> Two to a pull around. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> Hell yeah, it's eight. <laughs> I want that goddamn car. <laughs> And I want this girl. <laughs> I think I think I'm saying just, just replace both of us, goddamn. Two of them just switch our lives. Is that nigga Terry Ball? No, I look better than that nigga. Uh, That's damn. Real. Yeah. But I know I look better than him. No, if I, I had him. his money, that right. car. I'm on. <laughs> all the way on. Him, all That's the way super on. Super villain. That's crazy. <laughs> That's hate on the low, but hey, we gotta lean into it. Man, do things like that. Put your mama on the phone. <laughs> Never come back. Yeah. Take it easy. That nigga Rich Wild, take it easy. 